All right, yeah. So <clears throat> we're here at the MSF class. Um, they just finished. They're about halfway through the lessons, I would say. And Nicholas is riding that DRZ 400, the big Suzuki. It's a little bit of a heavy bike for him, but he's he's making it. He's making it happen. And um, let me see. Can I get these folks in the? Can you see them back there? Yeah. So. That's all that's going on. It's raining. It's cold. My fingers are numb. But um, I kind of, yeah, I don't know. I didn't, I don't even think I thought about riding with them today. But we're having a great time. It, 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 this is good. You can't beat dirt biking in the mud. Rock and rolls over and out. Here's Nicholas. He's practicing the starting and stopping on the DRZ 400, which is actually a street legal dual sport. Looking good. Sure that okay he kept the right foot up uh they dropped it Alright, this is probably the last recording I'm going to make today of Nick actually riding. I would say about half hour ago, 20-30 minutes ago, he really learned how to ride. He hit that moment. There's a couple of moments you see whenever people are out here learning to ride motorcycles. There's that first moment when they lift their feet up in the beginner's class. And then there's a moment in the advanced class when they really get that confidence on the bike. You see how he's standing on the bike. He's using the throttle to give it some power, to back off the power. He feels confident weaving between the cones. He's actually counter steering, leaning the bike over. All of that's what you want to see in a rider. All of that's what you want to see. I'm very pleased with his effort today. He dropped it a few times, but he picked it back up. Way to go, Nick. Rocket rolls over and out. Stop. What the heck? Did none of that get recorded? You gotta be kidding. I didn't record any of that. Ain't this some crap. I'm not going back around the block yet. Let me play with this first. <laughs> 